Hello friends! Welcome back to a new session. I am Teacher Michelle and today I will be your guys' host for Reading Extension. So, do you guys remember reading the book The Little Red Hand Makes a Pizza with Teacher Elsie? And it looks like, it looks like this. How about if we make a pizza just like The Little Red Hand did? Does that sound like fun, guys? Well then, let's get right into it. So, do you guys remember what the store Little Red Hen went to to buy pepperoni and pizza? Yes? That's right, she went to a delicatessen. A delicatessen is a store that sells special foods such as meats and cheese. So, let's pretend we're going to a store like that. Ready? One, two, three. Okay guys, we're here. A delicatessen. Just like how the little red hen went to. So, we need to buy some pepperoni and some mozzarella. So let's go look for them. After we're done picking up our supplies, we should go to the kitchen and get right into making our pizza. Okay guys? Ready? One, two, three. Okay guys, we're here. The kitchen. Okay, so after we bought our supplies, we should get started right on our pizza. So, what we need to do first is put on an apron. Do you guys know what an apron is? Well. Well, an apron is something you wear when cooking to keep your clothes clean. So let's put on an apron. Okay, now that we're all dressed up, let's get started with our dough. Do you guys know what dough is? A dough is a soft, thick flour mixture used to make baked goods. Okay guys, so let's get started with our pizza. So, we have to choose our dough. I'm gonna choose the white one. Okay. Okay, so now that we have our dough, we have to knead it. Kneaded means to mix it by pulling, by pulling and pushing and pulling and pushing it all together. Just like the little red hen did. She kept pushing and pulling and pushing and pulling her dough for it to be ready to become a pizza. So after you're done kneading the pizza dough, you have to go look for a pizza pan. So now we should rummage through our kitchen drawers to look for a pizza pan. You guys know what rummage means? Rummage means to look for something by moving things around. So when you open the cabinets of your kitchen, you have to push away all the big pans to look for your pizza pan. Okay? It's like how the little red hen rummaged to her kitchen drawers to look for her pizza pan. So after you have found your pizza pan, you have to place the dough on the pizza pan and spread it out. After that, we have to pick our sauce. We have to put on our tomato sauce. Spread it all nicely, nice and even. Lots of tomato. Now that we have kneaded our dough, rummaged through our kitchen to look for our pizza pan, placed our dough on the pizza pan and put on tomato sauce, we should put some cheese. So let's go to the cheese section. I like shredded mozzarella, so let's put some shredded mozzarella. You can choose whatever you want. We'll put this put on some cheese okay guys I think that's enough cheese right or should we add some more cheese let's add some cheddar cheese okay now let's go to the meat section let's place some pepperonis you guys can put whatever you like let's go to the veggies you can't leave out the veggies right um I like green peppers so I'm gonna put some green peppers and I like mushrooms too, so let's put some mushrooms. Okay, I think we're done, guys. Let's press cook to cook our pizza. Okay, guys, I think our pizza's done now. Okay, can you guys see the smoke coming out of the pizza? That smoke coming out of the pizza has some scent, and that scent is really delicious. Do you guys know what delicious is? Delicious means something that tastes really good, and I think this pizza smells delicious. Okay, now that our pizza is ready, we should let it cool down. And if you're generous enough, you should give some to your friends and family. Do you guys know what generous means? Generous means to give or share something with others. So if you're feeling generous, you should give some to your family or your friends. Because afterwards, they will feel grateful that you gave them a piece of your pizza. Do you guys know what grateful means? Grateful means to feel or to show thanks to someone. So if you give them a piece of your pizza, they're going to definitely be grateful. Well then guys, that's all for today. 
Hope you guys had fun. So now we're going to move on to Let's Find Out About. Bye.